Hi there my fellow subs, welcome back to my channel Investment Mindset. Today in this video, I'd like to share my technical analysis on Bumi Armada Berhad Stock Ticker Armada trading on Bursa Malaysia. Before I dive into its technical analysis sharing, firstly allow me to share some background check on the stock. Bumi Armada Berhad is a Malaysia-based international provider of offshore energy facilities and services. The company's revenue is derived from business segments including floating production, storage and offloading or FPSO operations, floating gas solutions and offshore marine services. This stock came to my radar recently when my stockbroker sent me the list of top losers and and that's when I saw how Armada stock crashed by 23% within a day that is on the 6th of June with huge volume to around 266 million versus its average volume of about 66 million which is about 4 times its daily average volume transaction. So when I dig in further, I found out that the stock price crash was due to the suspension of its production at an offshore facility in the North Sea. I did not buy into it on the next trading day which is on the 7th June as I have yet to see any buyers stepping in to buy into this stock. So I put a mother stock under my watch list instead. On the 3rd and 4th trading day though there was some buying to push the stock's price slightly higher from the last closing price of 44 of 45.5 cents to a high of 47.5 cents before retracing back to close at 46.5 cents which is about 10 cents higher. But based on the candle form on both the third and fourth trading day, I could see that the selling pressure was still not over. True enough, on the fifth trading day, that is on 12th of June, which was yesterday, we saw another round of sell-off from a high of 48 cents to close at a low of 42 cents. In fact, yesterday, one of my subscribers did PM me on my IG asking me if it's a buy for a mother stock now at that at this level. I did tell him that though at the price range of 43 to 44 cents, a mother stock is attractive enough but I have yet to see any real bias coming in. So my advice to him was to maybe buy a small position into a mother stock and when we see the stock to have finally show some basing and consolidation, then only add more onto his position. And this morning, I decided that it's time for me to nibble my position into Amrata. Firstly, based on my technical measured move, where Amrata stock should find strong support level at around this level of 42 to 43 cents. Secondly, I find Amrata stock to be attractive at this level. So I bought in at around 42.5 cents this morning. As long as a mother stock is able to hold above this level of 42 to 43 cents, the likelihood of a mother stock to surge back up is on the higher probability side. My first upside target price will be around 48 cents, and if a mother stock is able to break through this level, then the next target price will be at around 52 cents. Fundamentally, if we are to look at this article, we could see that Afing Huang maintained a buy rating on Amada with target price of 80 cents. RHB also maintained a buy rating on this stock but lowers Amada's target price to 73 cents from the original of 80 cents. And so far, the lowest target price was issued by Hong Long Analyst with a buy call with target price slashed to 54 cents from 87 cents. So even if we are to base on Hong Long analyst target price of 54 cents, to me, to buy a mother stock at current price seems like a no-brainer. And of course, I also find out that a mother stock net tangible asset price per share is currently at around 90 cents per share. Of course, there is no guarantee that a metal stock will not trade lower than this current price as anything could happen in the stock market. But for me, I am taking my calculated risk to place trade on high probability play and with a comfortable position sizing as always. 
This is the end of my sharing for today. Would appreciate if you could smash on the like button to let me know if you have found value in my sharing today. May the good Lord bless you and your family abundantly and I shall see you again in my next video. Ciao!